Okay. How you feeling? <laughs> Behind the scenes of X Bar? Hank, we're talking about audio guys. <laughs> I feel good. Um, I went running this morning and I was thinking about today's workout and we're gonna train back and calves. And I thought, you know what, how am I gonna inspire these guys? I just ran like five miles up a hill. My calves already hurt. And I was trying to tell the camera guy, I'm a little worried. You know, I mean, my job is to inspire and motivate. And then I thought, you know what, no. I'm 10 times more relatable. How many people are gonna be standing, hit and play today, and they are already sore. They're already tired. They're already worn out. Mentally, they're, they're tired of their kids. They're tired of their job. <laughs> like, tired is, is just, you know, a general statement for us being. I was tired. I was hurting. And I was worried about my ability. But you know what? I did what I asked others to do, and I went and got in front of a camera, went and got in front of my TV, and I trained with America. You guys are training with me, David Kimmerly. So I want you to know that I don't wait till I'm fresh and come in here and kick my own butt. I have to go through the day-to-day -day activities like everybody else, and then work on my personal physical health potential. Today we're doing it with the X-Bar. And I'm proud that I was able to get in front of the camera and, and have a, a workout, whatever it seemed like to you guys, that, uh, that made me sweat, made my back hurt, made my calves burn, and with all those sense of accountability, I know we're gonna help me reach my goals. So if you guys can relate to this at all, if you were tired when you woke up and somehow you, you hit play and you're just pushing along, well, you are not alone. And one of the biggest tricks to transformation is realizing you are not alone. You are not more hungry than me. You are not in more pain than me. Your ability is not less than mine. You know, I could go on and on and on about my excuses and reasons, same as the next guy. It's the old argument, you know, I turned my ankle. It's hard to have somebody relate. Okay, I turn my ankle, the guy next to me turns his ankle at the same exact time. Still, the two of us are gonna look at each other and, and think that the other doesn't relate. Oh, yours doesn't hurt as much as mine. Or, oh, you're a girl, so it, it hurts less. Your pain threshold's higher. You plug for the ladies. Or maybe you're a girl and it, it, uh, your threshold is lower, so it hurts you more. We're all gonna lie to ourselves and think that we're alone, we're in our own little pain, because that's what it feels like. But it's not true. And the trick to life is, realize, the trick to life is realizing that. Is realizing that Somebody's done what you are trying to do most of the time, especially in this body transformation stuff. Somebody hurt when they ran, somebody couldn't breathe when they ran, somebody had their brain just screaming at them to stop, somebody had, had every excuse just flowing through their brain to stop. Especially when you're using fat, that's your body security, it doesn't like that. <laughs> you, wanna, you, wanna, you wanna use fat to fuel the, our X-Bar workout? Your body's gonna hate you. What does it do? Starts a conversation, you're to stop. Stop burning my security, stop burning these, these proteins that I've stored in case the world ends. <laughs> you know, it's a simple, simple uh, staying alive process your body will do. That conversation is a very hard one to win and it took me 10 years until I finally got inside myself and said no. No, 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 no. I have a goal, I will reach it and this is only my head telling me to do something that it thinks is right. I know exactly how many calories a day I'm eating. I know why I'm eating them. I know how many calories a day I'm burning. I know what kind of calories they are. I know that I'm not starving. Even if you think I am, I know I'm not. Having learned those things and, and, and that, that, uh, that accountability, the, the, the knowledge, I know my body's fed. So no matter what happens up here, I win. You're just hungry. Or you just want something. Or you're just burning my fat and you don't like it. Shut up brain and do your job. Burn my fat, be hungry. You've been fed. It's your inspirational talk from David Kimberly and the X-Bar, KimberlyPlan.com. Signing out, hope you got something from this. Just remember, anytime you're hungry, anytime the fridge is open, your last meal was at 10 and it's midnight, it's possible to shut it. And the way you'll feel in the morning when you do, <sighs> you, you go to my Facebook, David Kimberly, and you tell me how, what it felt like to shut that fridge days in a row. It's a neat experience.